Hello everyone and welcome to the first ever of truly official episode of Anacraft. As you have noticed, we have not put out any videos on our channel recently. That is due to several reasons. Uh, mainly being that the amount I was paying for the server rights to use said server only included a certain amount of memory. I kept upgrading it as much as I could to what I could spare cash-wise for the Amazon Minecraft server for the Lexington Return Centers as I could, but unfortunately running the ATM3 modded Minecraft server just did not work out. Um, too many issues arose from such limited resources. However, me and uh, another worker there are working on a custom built server that we will house here at my house that will run the ATM3 server. However, until then, we have switched to a mostly fully vanilla Minecraft server, and we have not had any issues out of it. <clears throat> so, I guess I will go ahead and log in. Wow, server is empty right now. <clears throat> and, welcome to spawn. I do have my game modded with many map mainly because I suck at coordinates. And yeah. But this is the super smelter. It's a community super smelter for us to use. This was a prototype uh cobblestone generator for this build right here. Uh this worked all the way up to one dot twelve. However, with the new water physics in one dot thirteen, unfortunately. I'm going to have to go into Creative World and try to make this again, where it will work. Uh, lava was on this side, water was on this side, and as the lava and water flowed, water flowed way too fast, and it wound up making the cobblestone a block over. One idea I'm going to try to do to fix this is move the pistons over one and see if that will fix it. But anyways... Uh, show you what we're doing over here. Over here we are making a map room. A very, very big map room. This way people can choose where they want to go to start out their Minecraft careers on here. Also, this whole server is legit. Um, some of the mods we're using that work on this is, say, we want a virtual chest. We type in chest, and there's my virtual inventory. Um, and then we have like a workbench, which is just a normal bench, as you can see. Uh, we go up another set, and here's the very center. <clears throat> <clears throat> Looks like corrosive has been busy building. Um, this map is going to be this big, but I plan on hijacking the server one day when everyone is off. And while in creative, try to expand it further back. Uh, head on down. Over there is uh, Rainforester's base. Yes, this is part of 1.13. This is... Like I said, a very lowly modded server. I will eventually show you how it is all built. And that's his mine. I will go ahead and get out of there for now. Crap. I don't have any armor on. He likes to kill me. Uh, one of the rules that we plan on implementing is no PvP unless it's done in an arena. Um, let's see. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba, da, ba. I hope we have fire tick turned off. We have a lava underfloor under there to help light it up. There was our best bet at getting a cobblestone generator. <laughs> you do know I am recording for the YouTube store, the YouTube series, right?
as you can see, it pushes out mostly stone. And of course, Corrosive works at the return center across the street from me. Um, so, yeah. I'm trying to figure out where he put. Let's see. Okay. Grab, wrong button. This is going to take some getting used to for me. Uh, but it should be. Wait, why is there. Really? Anyways, this was supposed to all be stone. Oh, I see why they did it. Never mind. Um, so, next step will be heading to my base. I am only jumping into spectator mode for whenever I want to get to a certain place fast at the moment. Actually, never mind that. We have TP commands that players can use. And this is my server, not his. One thing I like about this, it plays nice with the TP mod we have on server side. So say I want to head home, I can teleport straight to home. I am once again building into the side of a mountain. And so it's slowly getting there. I have a nice little water elevator thanks to Mumbo and all the hermits off of the Hermitcraft series. And this will be another little farm right here. Uh, I plan on going up another level and then keep going down and making one massive underground bunker basically. It will have a massive cave section that I plan on putting in for like trees and stuff. My nether portal is down there, so is my strip mine. Uh, I am out of food. Ba -ba -ba -da, ba -ba -da -ba -ba. As you can see, uh, this is my little egg thing. And it's full, so that means I can eventually build my chicken cooker. Uh, let's go see if we have any food. And then after that, well, unfortunately, one of our Emmacraft players will not be playing on the vanilla server. That is Doc, not DocM77. No, we just call him Doc because his uh, login name is Plague Doctor. Uh, so. Potatoes, carrots, he said something. And that's pretty much it for the tour. I guess my bed will be over here eventually. This is going to be my enchanting room. This is the wheat farm for the cows and sheep. And he's starting to creep me out. Also, if you notice... Oh. One thing, I cannot use world edit on here to save my life, so I don't even attempt it just in case I can't fix what I attempt. Therefore, I don't even try to attempt anything even in survival because I would be very sad if I lost everything. So, uh, I hope you all will enjoy the series. I plan on trying to rope corrosive and rainforester into making videos. Uh, corrosive because he has a computer similar to mine, so I know he can do it. Also, Corrosive is on Satnet, so the server might be kicking him off at the moment. Poor guy.
and it's becoming nighttime. So, I hope y'all will enjoy the series. Please ignore the skin. I gave up trying to change it back because a few of my friends have my login credentials, so they're always changing my skin back to a female variety. I would change my password, but like Corosa says, I'm too lazy to do it. Uh, and that's all there is to it. So, um, don't hate me. Uh, I will see you all later, and see you on the next episode.